Carver's Bay endured a losing season for the first time in 10 years with a 5-6 and six campaign, but Nate Thompson has a nucleus of sophomores and juniors that could get the Bears back to their winning ways. Uh, we've got a young team. Uh, the good thing about that young team is uh, we've got most of them back that played last year. And uh, the other thing is we have very few seniors. So it's, it's a situation where if, we, uh, if the kids uh, jail early and, and often this year, we know we've got them for at least another two years. The offense is paced by Deshaun Aiken, who will throw to keep defenses honest and can take off and run on his own. The Bears' calling card will remain their run game, a three-headed monster headlined by sophomores Devin Cutno and Hakeem Hampton. Like, we played together since middle school, elementary school, all that, so it's going to be big this year. We might go to state. It's our year right here. The 1A school that has existed for just 12 years has a remarkable three players in NFL training camps this summer and a number of D1 products over the years. The next in the long list is defensive lineman Nakaz Pringle, who's already got offers from Clemson and the Gamecocks as a rising junior. One day, one of the colleges called me and said, well, they like what, what they saw on film. And I said, what was that? And they were like, well, I like the way you rotate your hip pop your lock, do everything, move your hand, your rotation. And I said, wow, thank you, sir. And then once then, everything just stopped falling in place. With Pringle up front, the Bears also have two talents in the secondary, with quarterback Aiken joining Desmond Sumter, looking to break up pass plays. Carver's Bay moves into a new region and will need to oust the likes of new league foes Timminsville, Hemingway, and East Clarendon. And that conference is like the black and blue division. So you've got four or five teams in there that at any, when you, you show up with those guys, you better come to play. This year, we're looking to dominate every team in the region, state. We're going to be the number one team in the state. We just got to all get together and work together as a team and get what we need to get done.